Child pornography and sex trafficking. State police call it Kentucky's fastest growing crimes. WDRB's Lawrence Smith tells us what lawmakers are now doing to fight the problem. This is a Kentucky State Police unit dedicated to fighting internet crimes against children. The problem, police say, there is simply not enough money. KSP has five investigators who spend their full time online tracking the most awful images imaginable, including the rape and torture of children. Five officers trying to combat what may be Kentucky's fastest growing crime. We had nearly 10,000 child pornography files that were downloaded last year in Kentucky alone. What's even more alarming, says KSP Commissioner Rodney Brewer, is the number they don't find. Now there's a proposal designed to help. House Bill 427 is about protecting our Commonwealth's most vulnerable citizens. The bill would add a $10 court fee to all criminal convictions, with the money going directly to fighting child pornography. The money would be dedicated to personnel, equipment, and training solely for the state police. The bill is called Alicia's Law, named after Alicia Kosakevich. She was abducted by an internet stalker at age 13, bound raped and tortured live on the internet. But I was miraculously rescued because of the FBI, because they had the funding and the resources to find and rescue me. Alicia now crosses the country, pushing for bills like Kentucky's. Law enforcement has to watch this every day, and they have to say, I can't save you because I don't have the funding, I don't have the manpower, I don't have the resources. And that's what Alicia's law will give. The bill easily passed the House Judiciary Committee and now goes on to the full House and the Senate. If the bill becomes law, sponsors say it could raise some $3 million to help prevent future Alicia's. In Frankfurt, Lawrence Smith, WDRB News.